I'm Ellen Finkelstein with a quick tip to help you create and deliver outstanding presentations that are effective and compelling. This is part two of a three-part series on how to create a chart in PowerPoint from Excel data so that the chart matches the style of your PowerPoint presentation. In part one, I showed you how to bring the data from Excel into PowerPoint and create the chart in PowerPoint. But what if you have already created a chart in Excel and want to use that? In this part, I'll show you how easy it is to bring that chart directly into PowerPoint while matching the look of the presentation. These steps work for PowerPoint 2007 and 2010. Have your Excel spreadsheet open, as I do here, with your chart visible. Then return to PowerPoint and use a slide with a layout that contains content, like this one and click inside the content placeholder to select it. That's because you'll be replacing the placeholder with the chart. Go back to your Excel spreadsheet and select the chart by clicking it. Now copy it to the clipboard. Notice that the chart uses the default office theme colors including red, blue, green, teal, orange, and purple. Back to PowerPoint. If you press Control V on your keyboard, you can immediately see that the chart colors changed. They now match the boxes at the bottom of the slide here, which use the PowerPoint theme colors. How did that happen? When you paste, by default, the Paste Options drop down list right over here appears at the lower right corner. If you click this down arrow, you can see that you have a couple of options. The default is, to, is this one right over here to use the destination theme and link the data. And that's why the chart automatically picks up the new colors. If you want, you can choose another paste option. Many people don't want to link the data because then the Excel file needs to accompany the PowerPoint file all the time to avoid problems. So we'll choose this option over here, which is Use Destination Theme and Embed Workbook. The chart is still consistent with the rest of the slides, but it embeds instead of linking it. So bringing your chart from Excel to PowerPoint and matching the PowerPoint colors is as easy as copy and paste and clicking the option that you want. But what if you don't want to embed the chart? There are two reasons you might not want to do that. First, if your spreadsheet is very large, embedding that chart embeds the entire workbook and your PowerPoint file becomes very large. The second is that anyone who gets your PowerPoint presentation can open the Excel spreadsheet, but you might want to keep parts of it that are not the chart, the rest of your data, private. So in part three, the last of the series, I'll show you another way to get an existing Excel chart into PowerPoint in a way that doesn't embed the entire worksheet yet still matches your PowerPoint colors. Mm -hmm.